Hey Libra, welcome to your reading. This is for you, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I hope you all are doing well. Let's get into it. See what is coming to Libra in love, please. Libra. Libra, you have the Seven of Wands. Let's come into Libra in love, Libra. The Knight of Pentacles. So you may be dealing with a Virgo. I do read that card as Virgo. Okay. Three of Cups was coming to Libra in love. The Hermit. So Libra, this could definitely be somebody that um, you are currently just dating, okay? You could be mingling and things like that. And this is someone that you're mingling with at this present time, or you will be, okay? Or this could be someone that you are friends with, okay? So I am hearing uh, someone within your friends group could have a crush on you, could like you, maybe you do. Let's come into Libra and love. Let me get two more cards. Ace of Cups and the Four of Wands. All right. So yeah, Libra, um, I am hearing that some of you, this could have something to do with just getting out of another relationship, okay? So we may have recently got out of another relationship or situation, and it just seems like right now they really do want to date you, Libra. That's, that's coming in real strong, okay? This person does want to date you. But it just seems like they still need, like someone still needs more time to kind of like process things or heal from something else. Okay. Let's say you and this person broke up. Someone could definitely be considering like a new beginning with you um, after some time away from each other. But it, it's crazy because you have the Ace of Cups as well. So the Ace of Cups would indicate that would definitely suggest that there is still a potential and a possibility for love between you and this person. Even if it seems like you guys are just friends, even if it seems like, okay, maybe they will, may not want to get back together, but there is something about taking your time, um, not wanting to rush into that, but that is where they're headed with you, Libra, okay? Now, someone may be experiencing some kind of pushback here with the seven of wands, like, look, okay, um, I'm not ready for that right now, but I am interested in getting to know you and spend time with you, okay? But don't rush me on this. Don't push me on this. Um, I feel like trust is definitely something that may need to be earned again in this situation, okay? Especially if you had a relationship with each other and there were, you know, it was a bit tumultuous, right? Um, you have change of hearts. You have declaration of love, okay, and on my mind. So you're definitely on this person's mind, Libra. Um, you know, the Ace of Cups wouldn't be here if, you know, there was, this was just going to be a friend thing or whatever, or just platonic. No, I think that there are some feelings of, you know, romantic feelings amongst you guys. But I just think that someone doesn't want to just rush into that Libra. They need to be super, super sure. Seven of Wands for Libra. Yeah, this could be someone that you broke up with. You know, you guys separated. We do have Gemini here. Someone's thinking about, I don't know if I should get back together with this person or not. I was like, someone's not saying no, but they're not saying yes. It's like, well, let me, let me think about it. Let me think about it, Libra. Yeah, so I'm here for some of you. Maybe this person got out of a relationship recently. And although they do have romantic feelings towards you, it's still not something that they want to jump into. But you're going to have to be hella patient for this because the Knight of Pentacles moves very slow.
Someone's definitely being pulled in two different directions. We could be connected to a Cancer. Ace of Pentacles reverse. A third party may have definitely been present in the past. Okay. Look what someone's thinking about. What's on somebody's mind is the Two of Cups. They know that the feelings, the love is there. But they're still um, apprehensive about just getting back into a relationship or being in another relationship. What is this hermit? The hermit would suggest that someone's taking time for solitude. Someone's taking time for themselves. Maybe still figuring out what it is that they want. Okay. Aquarius energy. Three of cups. Like, should we stay friends or should we be more, you know? Yeah. Somebody wants to be more than friends, though, in this situation. They do. But it's like, there's a bit of avoidance about that. Like, look, um, what is it going to be? <laughs> so, Libra, somebody may want to come out of the friend zone with you. Okay. What else for Libra in this love situation? Ace of coins. The potential is there. Like someone needs to kind of make that final choice here. Like, are we more than friends or what is it going to be? Because someone, you know, the potential is there. It is. You have the Ace of Wands. But there's a feeling of like, okay, I want to guard myself. I want to protect myself though. You know, um, hearing there could be like a physical separation, uh, like someone could be in jail or someone may have been in a therapy or somebody, um, this may be a long distance kind of connection here. So that's what's going to happen here, Libra. You know, um, the love will be offered. The connection will be there. But, I mean, it's up to someone to say yes or no to this. Right now, it still looks to be something that could go either way. Either way. So if it's this person that has yet to take you out of the friend zone and things like that, are you wasting your time? Yes and no. Okay? Yes, because obviously you never know when someone may change their mind. Um, the Knight of Coins moves very slow. If you have patience, then you could, you know, wait on them and see it through. Um, and no, because like I said, I think what's at stake here is love, new love between you that and you and them. Okay. So Libra, you have trust issues. Are trust issues justified or unjustified? Trust is imperative to feeling safe and secure. Okay. Must list be unapologetically self-loving. Must has and release it to the universe. Okay. You do have talking again. Texting, reconnecting, open up a dialogue. Second chance, back in each other's world. Expectations, confirm if you want the same things. Prioritize the relationship. Okay. Okay. Emotional intimacy, healing relationship with self, inner child precedes successful relationships. Love is energy. I haven't used these cards in so long, but kind of miss them. All right, my Libra, that is what I have for you. Libra, somebody wants to be more than friends. That's what they want. Okay. Someone says my life is a disaster. Okay. I can't move on. We do have Virgo taking you out on a date. Okay. Time to heal. Afraid to love. Falling hard and deep. So yeah, Libra, this may be someone that you you just don't really trust for X, Y, Z reason. It doesn't even mean they did anything, but trust is, plays a major part in this situation. Okay. Uh, you have liar, cheater. So maybe this person has a history of doing that. We have Aries. Needs therapy. Missing you is driving me crazy. 
best I ever had. Okay. So what, someone in this situation, like, look, I only want a friendship or I only see this as being a friendship right now. Okay. The grass wasn't greener. All right. Ooh, that flew out. Insecure, low self-esteem, deep-seated issues. Yeah, so somebody definitely wants more from this, okay? They want more from this. And if you're in a relationship, Libra, then I'm here. Yeah, there is something about earning the trust back as well, okay? Going on more dates and things like that. Earning the trust back. Yeah, this, this person wants to be more than just friends. That's the truth, okay? Definitely could be a Virgo, Moon Rising, or Venus, okay? Okay, Libra, so that is what I have for you. Thank you guys for tuning in. It was a pleasure reading for you. I hope this helped you. And talk to you guys soon.